Hi everyone, I am Zulekha. I am talking about uh, the movie Mel Mele Morales. Um, I watched uh, this movie in the documentary as we are celebrating the ethnicity, uh, race and power uh, month of A AAPI, Asian American and Pacific Islanders. In this uh, event, I watched Mele Morales. It's very inspirational. The it is a documentary movie, uh, and uh, it was represented by uh, Estria and uh, Prime. Prime is John Prime. These two artists, uh, graffiti art artists, who um, who are who are locals of Hawaiians, and uh, they represented the art art through culture and they painted the walls with beautiful designs uh, all over the walls. The designs represent the culture of Hawaiian culture and the ethnicity class uh, is representing the culture of Pacific Islanders. I am talking about uh, AAPI, uh, Asian American Pacific Islanders and the month is uh, um, celebrating about the ethnicity, power and race. In this movie, um, the two artists and the villagers of the community of uh, Mike, Mike, Mikey, Mike, Mikey and uh, they represented how the Hawaiian culture is, uh, you know, is identified. As I'm taking the ethnicity class, um, we are talking about positioning, uh, positionality, decolorization, and de uh, and colonialism. So positionality and also intersection uh, intersectionality. So in positionality, the uh, how people are treated, Asian Americans and the people from foreign countries, people from different diverse cultures are being treated the positionality is how uh, it is uh, they are doing the weightage the targeting the people like uh, the race the power the sex and uh, yeah culture community tradition so the position is uh, economical position of a person or the position the uh, male and female genders and uh, the position is like how how you are being treated as a human being and from different culture in the US and um, also like uh, by watching this Mele Morales it justifies the artists are representing the Hawaiian culture through their art the painting the walls uh, with beautiful designs like uh, Manova painting, the painting of Manova and uh, the trees, the plants, everything, the design comes over uh, graffiti and decolonization and colonialism. When we are talking about decolonization, it's, you know, we, ha we should have the determination and power of sovereignty, having the power of, uh, you know, giving the rights to the indigenous sovereignty and liberating the indigenous people uh, from the you know, like uh, economic power and from the policies, the U.S. federal policies upon the ethnic uh, indigenous people, uh, like uh, the Pacific Islanders are, are not able, they do not have the right to vote. So this is the, by decolonization, we should have determination, power and willpower to have sovereignty and re to represent our roots, our culture. And uh, colonization is, uh, you know, being, being uh, you are targeted, you know, colonization is, you know, we are, uh, you know, suppressing your personality um, by racism and by showing your culture like you are minor minority and you not, do not have power to be you know, to have equality in the U.S. Uh, um, US uh, America 
so through this movie mele morals uh, i really got inspiration how how the how the people the community is supporting the youngsters are supporting um, you know intersectionality we can see the youngsters they are connecting to the culture the, in the movie and how they um, there are like sacred places like manova uh, honolulu and all uh, kanaki so uh, the main painting was uh, represented by uh, prime and estria is about manova and how she she is looking and at the end she uh, she was represented in their culture so it was like very beautiful painting i can show you in this uh, uh, in the painting of manova how it was transformed transformed she how she is looking at the end how she was looking at the end uh, in a natural way also the youngsters are connecting to their roots their culture the hawaiian culture and the japanese culture are intertwined and uh, connected um, so it was a great movie i really got inspired and uh, how the hawaiian culture is identified and represented by istria and prime the main artists and uh, how graffiti wall painting is good and it's not bad and it is not stereotype and the uh, mural project was uh, uh, promoted by the community from the hawaiian uh, my my mikey also i really um, enjoyed the movie the uh, songs the music the ethnicity uh, the painting is very creative uh, and the connectivity with the spirituality in the sacred places where they give importance to water and the dancing of dolphins and how the both the artist uh, they represented the movie and uh, they represented the culture the connect they connected Uh, the culture and the tradition and music and songs everything was beautiful and it exemplifies the culture of hawaii and they are uh, they are showing their power through and race thank you have a great day